Hello, hello roommates. I'm coming at you from the blue room, but it's not going to be a how to design video. Instead, I am having a problem with my Cricut and no one could help me. So I figured I would try something and we're going to test it out and see if it works. So here's my idea. The first thing is, what's the problem? Well, the problem is these rollers. Well, let me back up. I've had my Cricut since Christmas of 2019. So a couple months before the pandemic hit, I got this Cricut. My husband bought it for me. So it's been about four years at this point. These rollers are worn because I be working in here. Okay. So <laughs> what's happening now is the rollers are moving onto my space. So it's eating up my mat and like messing up the orientation of my mat and what's going on there. So what I've been having to do, what I've been having to do is grab my weeder tool and I have to like dig into this and like roll it back until it's on the like indention in the bar right so that's what I've been having to do but imagine you're working hard your mat gets messed up I want to step away and use the bathroom or go cook dinner or whatever the case is and this thing comes back and it's all jacked up so I had to find a way to fix it so here's what I came up with I need something to keep this roller I needed something to keep this roller from coming over here I have been trying to put these here but they still be moving so Instead, we are going to use electrical tape. That's right. I found it in one of the tubs in my closet. So this is what we're using. And my goal or my hope is that um, this tape will wrap around the bar and serve as a star wheel. But I wanted to keep my star wheels because I need to be using those in my when I make my projects. So electrical tape. I'm not even going to measure it out. I'm just going to grab a little piece and I'm going to put this on my bar like close to where the wheel is there's like an indention i don't know if you can see that um but there's an indention right here i'm just gonna put my tape right close to that as close to that as possible okay cool so i'm gonna start with my cricket off and then when i cut it on the tape is going to wind itself around the bar and i'm gonna move it a little bit closer because i want it to be you know, take up as little space in my bar as possible. Okay, so my Cricut's off right now. I'm getting ready to turn it on. Your job is to make sure that the tape is straight so that, you know, you can overlap in a straight line. So when I cut my Cricut on, the tape is winding itself. That's it. There you go. And then I'm going to grab a piece of... Grab a piece of... I'm going to grab some scissors and I'm just going to cut. Right, right there. Oh, maybe I need thicker scissors. It's okay, I got those. There we go. Okay. Now, an issue I foresee is that the electrical tape is thick. And so when I try to put a mat under there, maybe it won't fit, but I don't know. We, we just gonna have to test it out. I'm gonna go ahead and do this other side though, because um, why not? So I'm gonna cut my machine off again, grab my electrical tape again. This was from Walmart. I think it was like $1.97. Um, I actually had it laying around, so I bought it however much long ago, but I know I didn't pay a lot for it because I didn't need it for I didn't need too much of it, which is why I have a ton of it left. So I've lined up my electrical tape and now I'm going to cut my machine on and navigate the tape so that it's straight. And then just kind of let it do its thing. And that's it. Now, I guess what you could do. Well, I guess it would depend on if it was thick enough um, here. But I was thinking you could like spiral the electrical tape from one end to the other. Um but I think it wouldn't be thick enough to keep the wheel in its place. I mean, it's thick, but I don't think that's thick enough. So now I got electrical tape on the two ends. My star wheels are still available to slide to and fro. So let's grab a mat and see if this works. We're about to find out. So there we go. All right, my mat's going there. I think we got a winner. 
I am excited. Oh my gosh, because I did I could just straight up, I could not afford another Cricut machine. Um, we're getting there though, coming soon. If you learned something from this video, please let me know below. Um, it was such a struggle to find help. So if this helped you, please, please, please let me know. Thank you so much for stopping by. Good luck with your Cricut and happy crafting. Bye.